you guys. Today we'll go back to Verzaska for a session. I will bring 10 minute run to a spot where I can put it. It's around 10, 12 meter, maybe even 16 meter minute ramp. I don't know if it's possible. I also booked a few days ago a GoPro Max. I will try it a bit. I have no experience with it. I have this floaty with the mouth uh, with the mouth uh, thing. So I can put uh, the GoPro into mouth with the floaty and try to do a few POVs. It's kind of scary to jump with it, but I think if I start with some easy jumps, it shouldn't be too bad. Get a bit of confidence with it, see how it feels, and then try to do other stuff to, to get some POVs. So yeah, hope uh, also to get a few good clips with the Max, to try no experience with it. So probably uh, we'll have to try a bit to edit the clips after I film uh, at 360 degrees so now we'll prepare all my stuff and see you at the spot so I'm still home I was going to Verzaska before I went to the bus stop and uh, the bus was not coming so I've lost my coincidence with the other bus for Verzaska and it doesn't make sense to go there with the next bus since it come at uh, since I will be on the spot at 4 p.m. so will be pretty late to do even a, a warm-up since I was planning to do some quad flips. I think I will go instead to Lido Locarno to try a bit the Bite Mount and the GoPro Max because uh, yeah, no bus coming today. From what I've heard, uh, it's uh, already two hours that the bus are not coming. I don't even know if are, they're coming later. I prepared my bike to go. So it's the only thing I can do for today. Hopefully on the weekend I will make this session possible with the tramp and see if I can do something. So yeah, see you at the pool now. So I've decided to film a bit while I go to the pool to try a bit the uh, bite mount while going with the bike and look how dirty it is it's uh, more than a year that uh, I don't use my bike I don't even remember which one is the the key to, to the lock so let's try to see I don't even remember. I think I've tried every key at least once. Maybe it's not even in my, in this uh, one of these. Okay, I found uh, this key inside my home. I think this has to be the right key. Let's try. Oh. Perfect. So it's not too bad to hold the GoPro in the mouth but uh, after a while holding it it becomes a bit heavy so yeah but if it's only for doing a jump uh, short moments it shouldn't be too bad now we'll still film a bit then put away the GoPro and then see you directly at the pool or if I stop somewhere to check Okay, now I'm at the pool. We we'll start easy since my legs are a bit tired from the from the bike ride since it's been a long time. I will now try to do a few flips with the GoPro in my mouth, starting with a simple barani from tree to see how it is to hold it while flip while doing flips.
Okay, let's try to make a flip this from five with it. It's kind of scary with the GoPro in my mouth, but <laughs> what can go wrong? I think uh, on the worst I will uh, make the GoPro fall. <laughs> Okay, holding the GoPro wasn't too bad with a flip fist. Now we'll try again because the GoPro moved a bit. I've made uh, maybe now it shouldn't move uh, anymore. Yeah, it's uh, much better. So I will try again, then probably it will, I will do something else with the GoPro in my mouth. Okay, that one was better. Now we'll try to do a gainer with the GoPro in my mouth. So I think uh, I will stop for now with the POV videos. I will try to use a bit the uh, GoPro Max. I will take the, this GoPro to film what I do with the Max. To film the setup and everything. So yeah, let's try the new GoPro. So yeah, I'm on the 5. I think I will place the GoPro Max here. It should uh, film uh, everything around if I'm on the 360 mode. So when I come uh, with the run-up it should film me. And then it should uh, continue to film uh, when I jump. I don't know how far it will film, so this is just a test to try. Let's try uh, to see how it, how it is. Okay, so from looking at the GoPro, on the video on the GoPro it looks good. I had to ask someone to hold the GoPro because uh, by putting it up, putting the GoPro down, I was not in the video on Little X since it was filming too low. Maybe with the editing it uh, might work. If I have uh, my gadget to put the GoPro on the railing, I call the film like this it should uh, work well so we'll go to see in my bag to if i have it if not i will try another time okay i have it i will do a flip fist from five trying to put the gopro on the railing and see how the video looks okay so i've put the camera like this i don't know if now it's filming in vertical or not i will try to do a flip fist filming with this setup and then in the editing I will try what uh, it comes out okay so setup worked I think the video is good but I have to see from the when I will edit on the app to make it a normal video we'll have to try it this evening now we'll do a double gainer try to film with it and see how it is so I've put away the GoPro Max to not make too many videos today I don't want to have uh, too many things to work since I have to experiment a bit with the editing first so we'll work a bit on these few videos this GoPro is almost uh, out of battery maybe I can do a few few more video later in POV for now we'll stop filming and if I will try something I will uh, put it in the video later okay we'll make one more clip with the GoPro in my mount I will do a Chukara from 5 yeah shouldn't be too hard to do Okay, it doesn't look too good, it uh, moves a bit the camera. I will try again with the stabilization to the maximum to see if it's better. So I decided to go with a flip fist, lost a bit uh, the bite on the GoPro in the second flip, but I think the video is quite good if I slow it down, you know. Since uh, the GoPro is almost empty, I will end the video. So this is all for today's video. If you like it, you can leave a like, subscribe, and see you in the next video. Bye, guys.